All right, who doesn't love puppies? New on Rising, we are live from the Gulf Coast Humane Society. Uh, after one of its biggest rescues ever that happened two weeks ago, Pooja Lodi is live to tell us more. Pooja, let's see the puppies. They're right here, and <laughs> these little guys have been named Jamie and Greg by the Gulf Coast Humane Society, not by me. David is the executive director. David, tell us how you came up with these names. Well, this is Greg, and Greg was playing in the water earlier. You know, he's an avid swimmer, so... Naples Pier. There you go. So he's still a little bit wet this morning, and of course, Greg's best friend is Jamie. <laughs> Aw, all they need now is little Slurpee cups for when they walk over to 7-Eleven together. Now, tell us a little bit about Jamie and Greg, all the other dogs out here that are going to be adopted this weekend. Well, they, uh, they've already been spoken for. They're uh, our first adoptions from the, the big rescue that we did a few weeks ago in Clewiston. Uh, these pups have already got their forever homes this Saturday. But we've got some more uh, foster uh, uh, pups that will be ready in a couple weeks. And, and so that's why we still need a lot of donations. And tell, tell us about that. I mean, I know you just recently got 64 different animals. I mean, obviously, this is putting a strain on your organization. You're a no-kill shelter. What does it mean for you? Well, we're a no-kill shelter. We receive no tax money of any kind, so we really rely on financial donations. So uh, we're, uh, we're kind of stretched thin at the moment. So any donations of, of money t monetary value and also puppy toys and blankets and towels, sheets, puppy food, uh, any donation would be greatly appreciated. Fantastic. Thank you. And thank you, Jamie and Greg. Thanks for coming out. Back to you, Liza. Two peas in a pod, aren't they, Pooj?